What up guys, this is Patrick from Top Tier Gaming. Uh, today we're going to do a little bit of an unboxing. I ordered the uh, Zodiac box set from Amanda La Palm and uh, came in the mail today. So uh, let's see how, how it looks. Alright, here we go. Amanda La Palm Zodiac box set. So I'm a big fan of Zoo. Uh, I was a fan of them before Zeus came out. I'm not huge on Zeus as a card. I think it's uh, problematic, but you know, that's a different talk for a different kind of video. And uh, let's go ahead and crack this thing open. Ooh, ow. Ooh. All right. Ooh. Good covering. Ooh. Oh, should pick it up like that. Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, that looks cool. That looks dope. Ooh, it's the uh, Zodiac calendar with all the zoo monsters on it. Ooh, okay, okay. I see what I'm really here for, but uh, we'll get to that in just a second. Here's one of the cooler things in here. It's a uh, set of dice. Ooh, some, oh, big hefty ones. I, uh, I have her hand trap dice, the ghost rolls. And I don't actually roll them because the paint on the chips very easily because they're hand painted. Which is kind of a shame, but they just go in the flex binder. But yeah, it's pretty cool. Here's one of the dice. It's got a wrap here. Whoa. I don't remember how to roll. That's a Thoroughblade. Whip tail. Whoa, where is it? There it is. Broad bull. Come on now. There you go. Broad bull. The best one. Where is she? Tiger mortar and Dryden. Mommy. Yeah, pretty cool. They're really heavy, like, uh, here. Whoa. They're pretty, they're pretty chunky dice. They have cute girls on them, and that's what matters. Oh, so let's go ahead and throw this one that's already open back in here, and we'll uh, put them over this side. There we go, we'll get to the mat last. Whoa. Whoa. All right, we got the pack of sleeves. These are pretty cool. They're uh, Bunny Blast. She's very cute. Uh, I'm a fan of Amanda's art, but um, it might be different with this set. The Orcus sleeves that I bought, the Galatea ones, they're a little tight on the card, so they usually end up poking out a bit at the top, which I'm not huge on. Uh, you'd have to use over sleeves um, to use them at all. Um, they're very good art though, so I would put them on extra decks, not on main decks personally. They are very nice though. Bunny Bust. Nice sign. She had an option to get, uh, I think it, it was red on the other part? I can't remember. Um, I know it was an optional um, choice on which ones you got, and I chose the siren because this is close to my favorite color, uh, mixed with pink. Then the uh, field center. Let's see what number we got. Let's see what number we got. Nice field center, metal, doesn't really bend. Got 156 of 260. Whoa. Nice metal back. Pretty cool. Dryden is mommy. Yeah, nice. All right, then the Tiger Mortar sticker, of course. Very cute girl, she's the cutest zoo. Whoa. All right, and next we got the mat. Let's go ahead and get this out the way. Oh, I can put everything back in there, actually. Who I came with? Oh, I lied. There's one more thing. Tiger Mortar Pen. Yes, goes with the collection. I've already got a Galatea and an Ecclesia. Very cool. Very cool. Let's see how big this is just on my palm for, for y'all. I have pretty small hands for a guy my size, but yeah. Nifty. Nice pen. Double backed. Rubber stoppers. I've, I've, again, got several of her pens, so I kind of knew what I was expecting there. Well, let's put this uh, field center back in a sleeve so it doesn't get all chipped up. Whoa. There we go. Still such a sweet box. Whoop, whoops. Forgot they were loose in there. Yeah, it's got the, like, Chinese imager. I don't know what to call that. Yeah, big wheel on it. Uh, it's got little stoppers on the back. 
so it doesn't slide around. Cool, cool, cool. All right, now on to the, the part everyone's here for, the mat. All right, pretty cool, pretty cool. Nice material, real silky. Nice mat, nice mat, okay. The side I'm gonna be using, of course, cause uh, girls. Real smooth, I like it. Cut evenly, so it's not like overlapping anywhere. This uh, pink spell ground that I'm opening this on is actually kind of miscut. So uh, it is like kind of uneven. Uh, let's get a full view of this real quick. Uh, here's a video for anybody that wants to learn how to fold spell grounds. So, first of all, never fold your straight in the middle. Uh, I don't know why, but for spell grounds, it's better if you leave this showing more on your side. Uh, so I'd leave it like this. Give it an extra, I don't know, what's that, inch? Yeah, about an inch. I can't see my thumb there. Give it about a, a thumb's width uh, of extra space. Take it, fold it down the middle, like that. Flatten them out again. Oops, what's it called? There we go. Yeah. Flatten it out. Take it. Fold half there. Or, I guess, third it. Third it. Then you're done. You can throw it in the bag. Uh, I don't have a bag for this one specifically. I'll have to use one of my uh, extra spell ground mats. Or spell ground bags. But yeah, that is how you fold your spell ground. I can actually do it on a spell ground, too. Here. See, this is what I mean by uh, give it some extra space. You want to leave it like this. So where you can see at least whatever emblem you want on the right. I always choose the goblet because it looks cool. And uh, also gives you space so you can see the, like, I guess zones for deck and drag. Alright, so, take it, fold it in half. Fold it third. And fold it third. There you go. And you can tuck it in the bag like this, this side going down or this side going down, so you don't have to worry about this catching on anything. You can just drop it in so it doesn't have anything to catch on. There you go. Take for the spell ground. A little bit of bonus content for y'all on this unboxing. All right guys, that's it for the unboxing. I uh, hope you like it. Uh, Man of Palms art's super good. Uh, product quality is usually very nice, and uh, I recommend picking it up if you have the opportunity. She does sell out very quick whenever these kind of things come around, so gotta get on top of it when you can. All right, this has been Patrick from Top Tier Gaming. Like and subscribe. Come. Come here. Oh. And this has been my dog. Goodbye.